And here we have Famous Monsters of Film Land number five. And it's from 1959, published by Warren. And this is in uh, fair condition with Owl 7 lightly tan pages. And what makes this fair especially is that the back cover is completely loose. It was split at the spine and it's separated. So this is what the back cover looks like. <clears throat> and it's not in terrible condition, but it's split on the spine, so it's separate. So I put it in the bag. The um, front cover is barely attached. You can see that the staple is, you know, not got a lot of space on it. That it can be attached. Actually, I think it's just becoming unattached as I do that. <laughs> well, no, I guess it's still it's uh, attached to the top, and it was the bottom that wasn't attached. But it's it's so barely attached that it may as well say we'll, we'll say that both covers are loose and split at the spine, and it is complete. The um, edges are darkly tanned. You can see there. But it is all, all there and it's all complete. And the inside is, um, is okay. Now some people will tape that back together. I don't do any taping myself. But it's available on my website. And oftentimes customers do put a tape down here. And they're happy with that. I, I don't do that. I sell it to them and I let them decide how they want to deal with uh, the magazine.